Today I decided to go along with the gold and berries with a bold red lipstick. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this holiday look. And if you want to continue to see how I created this look, then my advice would be for you is to continue to watch. So, let's get started. So, we're going to prime our eyes and today I'm going to use Max Parenthood Paint Pot and I'm going to apply it all over to the eyes, blending out very, very well with my ring finger. You can either use a brush or your fingers. It still will work out just fine. So, we're going to just blend it all out. And I know my face looks a little dry on camera, but I really moisturize my face very well. I'm going to have to check that out to see the reason why. But yes, so we primed our eyes. Off camera, I just applied the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil. So now we're going to, it milk. And now we're going to take the Lorac Pro palette. Then we're going to take that first shade that I showed you, Garnet. And we're going to apply Garnet into our crease. Now be careful because the Lorac Pro palette, if you're going to plan on using this palette, if you have it, you don't have to use these colors, but these eyeshadows in, these pal in this palette is very pigmented. You have to go very slightly with your brush. A little goes a long way, and you really need to really, while you're applying it to your eyes, you need to blend it out with the brush and also the crease. This is also our translucent color, and these are one of the colors that's going to stand out the most. So now we're going to take a sable, and we're going to use sable to touch up on some harsh edges. And we're going to use sable to really just add a little bit more color to the look, and also kind of clean up the extra excess on the eyes. Now we're going to take his gold and we're going to apply gold to the lids. Now you can use the original Naked palette and use Half Baked from that palette. If you have the uh, original Urban Decay Naked palette, you can use those shades and it'll still work. But I really don't think they have Garnet so in the palette that we use for the lids. But anyways, I'm going to take it and blend. Take the shade and blend. And also, I'm going to take cream, and we're going to apply cream as our brow bra bra highlight. I know it's a little bit too much, but this is for holidays, and you know you can go all the way out with holiday looks. Don't be ashamed to go a little bit extra, you know, for the holidays, because I don't usually get ashamed, but if you do it, forget. But now we're going to apply the same color to our inner corner. And also, I'm going to blend. And also, I kind of brought it up towards the side of my bridge of my nose a little bit. Because I like that. But we also have to blend that side too as well. Now we're going to take the shade black. And we're going to apply black to the outer V. Not all the way in the outer V. But kind of like at the corner of the outer V. And just a blend it, blend it, blend it, blend it away. And that will make the look look so gorgeous. You do not have to apply black to the crease. You can apply espresso from the palette. But you do not have to apply a black shade to deepen up the crease. That's just how I am. That's, I feel like the look is complete. So now we're going to apply some mascara to my lower lashes. And also, just gonna make sure we get all the little bit of stuff up. I applied my foundation, and it's gonna be listed below. Also, my other face products that I did not mention in today's video will be listed below. And also, off camera, I just finished applying the rest of the eyeliner and mascara, which will be listed below. So, I'm gonna take my Wet n Wild Color Icon Bronzer, and I'm gonna take it and apply it to the apples of my cheeks and also to the areas where I know where I need to contour and I'm just going to contour my face, temples and also jawline, just contour 
Make sure my face is really nice. Now I'm going to take Wet n Wild's Mellow Mauve and I'm going to apply it. Wow. Pigmented, right? So we're just going to take it and apply it to our cheeks. And you can wear it just like this, but I have a little trick here. Um, I like applying it to the bridge of my nose. I don't know why, just to give it some color. We're going to take a Total Face Brush from Elf. And this is going to really blend it out a little bit, make it look a little bit more softer. So here is the look. So let's go ahead and get to those nice, nice lips. Okay, so let's prime those lips. So we're going to use Carmax. Well, I'm going to use Carmax. You can use whatever lip liner you have. And I'm going to take it and I'm going to apply it to my lips. So my lips can feel moist and not dry. Because dry lips and a beautiful lipstick is not a great combination at all. And then I'm going to take a towel. Well, first I'm going to rub my lips in a little bit and then give it a little rub. And then I'm going to take a towel. I'm going to pat it just a little bit so it won't be too, too moist. I mean, it can be moist, but not moist to where it's hard for the lipstick to apply. Then I'm going to take the Elf Cosmetics Fearless Lipstick. I love it so much. I'm going to apply it to the lips. And this is like the perfect, affordable 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 lipstick only a dollar and how bold this is oh my gosh y'all are sleeping on L y'all do not own any other lipsticks pretty much I hope y'all did but we're just gonna take it I'm gonna apply it to my lips and this is going to be the final look and I hope you guys love it completed look and if you wonder what I use for my face and everything else it'll be listed down below and also all the products that I use from lips to eyes etc so I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'm glad to be back once again and I hope you guys are enjoying the holidays and I hope you guys really are loving the looks that I am giving so to, to continue to talk to me um, outside of YouTube I would like for you guys to go follow me on my Facebook like me on, follow me on Instagram, like me on Facebook, also follow me on Instagram, also Twitter, and also follow me on WordPress. So this was the look, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next video.